It is November of 2022, and it's almost been a year since Endwalker's release. It's also No Nut November, and within a few days, I've already failed. Once again, every year. What are we talking about again? After all the initial fun, the glitz, and the glamour of a new expansion release, as we approach 6.3, which is kind of like the halfway point between the life and death of Endwalker, people have kind of settled their opinions about the expansion and basically how they felt about it. And while many of us did find Endwalker to be a satisfying conclusion to a nearly 10-year-long saga, as well as providing fun content, I personally enjoyed the Yishtola sex scene. Oh, wait, did you miss that one? Well... You should have chose your Stola for that one scene room option. Stupid. We have now reached that point in the expansion where people decide that it's time to pack it up and quit 14 forever. And yes, we are starting to see those kind of contents. I quit 14, uh, quitting 14 forever, stuff like that. Some are unhappy with the state of 14 during this Endwalker life cycle, and there are some out there who want to quit 14 to pursue a career as a cam girl model. Okay, that last one's not true, but if that's true and that applies to you, hit me up and we'll make a video about it. We'll make a whole story. After watching about 30 seconds of one of these I'm quitting videos, it kind of got me thinking. I wanna leave too. I am quitting 14. Everything must come to an end, so does my journey with 14 today. Could I have totally gone out quietly, just quit the game, and you guys wouldn't have cared as much? Sure, but there's totally a viewership for this kind of content, so yeah, I kind of want that. Some of you with keen eyes may have noticed I haven't been logging in as much. I just been busy with other games like Terraria, RuneScape, Koikatsu. I do have my gripes about 14, and today, I'm gonna list a few of them. I love this game, but, you know, just like a good hentai, it must be consumed and you gotta move on eventually. Wait, uh... I said anime, didn't I? Here is my list of reasons as to why I'm leaving 14. Starting with, I have beef with the story in 14. I am not a fan. I am not a fan of how good it is. Too good, it, it makes me cry at points. Can Ishikawa-san please miss at least once? 14 team, please just make something mid for at least once. I'm tired of crying. I am tired for having to use all my tissues for crying. Now that I failed No Nut November, I need those tissues for other things. Tone down the emotional levels on the story. I need to save my tissues, please. 14 is honestly way too easy. This game used to be a lot tougher. After giving in to all the new players, this game is now a shell of its former glory. And I'm not talking about the situation where they nerfed the HP of the new raid boss. I missed the challenging fights of Cape Westwind. I missed it when Praetorium was like 30 minutes long. It allowed me to catch up on my Netflix shows. Now I actually have to do work. Bring back Cape Westwind as an ultimate trial. They did my boy dirty. My boy Ritat. He deserves more respect and he deserves an easier name to say. Broken promises. The amount of promises that the team has made but didn't actually go through with is frustrating. What kind of promises, you ask? Examples? Oh, uh, easy. I got a few. Um, female Hrothgars and... We've been promised female Hrothgars for a hot while now, and we still haven't gotten them. What gives, Mr. P? I just want to be handled by a big female Hrothgar. And my male Hrothgar friends are getting real tired of me having to call them up, get them all dressed up and looking cute, just so we can practice some exponential raid progression. But sadly, they're just gonna have to suffer for now because you guys haven't implemented that yet. I've held out for so long, but I'm giving up at this point. Black mages need more buffs. And I know we just received some, but it's not enough. They don't do enough damage for a supposedly powerful magic job that's supposed to wield the elements to deal damage, I always end up dying and not being a good black mage. Some may chalk it up to skill death, but I call those people jerks because it hurts my feelings. So to fix this, I have a proposal. I want black mages to one-shot everything in the game. Yes, and I mean everything. Set all potencies to 10,000. And while we're at it, I want them to have a resurrection ability because we've been overdue for one for such a long time now. Summoners have a res, red mages have a better res. I want black mages to have a group wide res. I'm talking multiple people at once. I want black mages to be a job that everyone should play. So also, while we're at it, remove all cast timers. Just give me insta-cast. Don't be a coward, Yoshi P. Give me my changes. I know you're watching. There is no dating system in 14. I play Persona, therefore everything should have a dating system at this point. I want to be able to hold Yoshtola's hands 
and ass without the use of third-party tools. Hey, whoa, hey, uh, this is, uh, post- co-editing uh, mode. Um, I don't use those tools. I'm just kidding. Well, you just cut it out. Forget this ever happened. <laughs> I am tired of being the little son of the community. If I can just have the opportunity to finally have Yashtola, I can no longer be that person. I can be the big son. There is no sex mode in this game. Nuff said. I'm going to say something that's going to shock a lot of you guys. I'm a butt guy. Boobs are nice, but butt is superior. We have no butt sliders still. The year is 2022 and we still don't have butt sliders. This is a change that not only I, but like a billion other players wanted. Well, okay, not really a billion. 14 doesn't have a billion players. That'd be, that'd be cool, but we don't have that much. I think we have about like at least a hundred. I don't want a flat ass anymore. I guess you can say 14's a bit behind the times. <laughs> <laughs> the asses of characters in this game is kind of like the butt end of the joke. I want my guy to have a big dumpy. I don't have big bazungas on my guy, so I need something else to compensate. So why not better than having a big ass? And if I don't get my butt slider options soon in this game, I am going to literally crack. <laughs> I applied for the position of CEO at Square Enix, but was never offered anything back. Albeit the position was never really open, but you know, uh, we shoot our shots. I think I would have done wonders as the CEO of Square Enix. For example, for one of my decrees as a CEO, decrees, wait, that's a, that's a king thing, right? I don't think CEOs say that. I would say no NFTs ever in the games. I know, thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome. And for my second decree, sex. <laughs> You're welcome. Yes, yes, yes. You guys really like that one, huh? But alas, you guys ignore my pleads for being the next CEO. You ignore all my emails. As a CEO, I think I would have made all the best decisions. I think I would have done things like, you know, discount my sub price to about a small percentage of 100. And everything I've discussed in my video would have been fixed if I was the CEO. Simple as that. I would listen to all the people so that all people who are quitting, you know, all five of you guys would stay. And with that said, that's all my reasons for quitting 14. I know, all extremely valid reasons. Will I be returning to 14 one day? No. Nothing will convince me to return to 14. Unless... If I get at least one like on this video, that's the only way. Heck, if I get at least one sub, I'll stay in the community. I know it's a hard ask, I know. So for that, I will say goodbye for now. Maybe I'll start doing Genshin Impact content. <laughs> I'll never do that. Maybe after quitting, I'll have a lot more free time to do other more productive things, like getting some bitches. Okay, maybe that won't happen, but you know what? I like to dream big. So with that, goodbye everyone. Thank you for watching. Okay, before you go, I actually do have a quick serious talk. If you can't tell yet, this was a more jokey video. I'm not really quitting, but I do want to make a video about the subject next. So the next video will be about the same subject, about quitting 14 in a more serious tone, so be on the lookout for that. And to wrap it up, uh, subscribe, like the video, and be sure to follow me on all my socials, so Twitter and Twitch. I'll see you guys later.